Hello everyone and welcome back to the city of Think of Thin in City Skylines. It looks kind of distorted from here, this big bed. There you go, now it's better. Alright, so today we are going to put in a few special buildings that um, I found on the Steam Workshop and they're all buildings that were built to enter the um, summer building contest initiated by the uh, the guys that made this game <laughs> and so modders are creating special crazy buildings and they're gonna put them in um, you know or, or they have them available and I'm gonna put them in I put up, I'm gonna put the ones that I think are best uh, before that we're gonna I'm gonna show you something really quick here I last time I put in an airport but I was like you know what I, I want two airports instead of one so I modified this a little bit, if you remember, it was just a straight road with the airport next to it. And now it is looking like this. I have a airport here, um, made by Drosovias, and it, it's neat, it's the, pretty much the same thing as the standard one. Um, and it looks cool if you go right, I'm gonna go first person view here, that's how it looks like. And it looks like I might be bumping the buildings next to it a little bit. But not really. Uh, and they both work, as you can see airplanes are leaving. Well, one, that one's leaving from there, the one on the right has an airplane landing. And look at that, they both work. It's a probably overkill, but we don't really care about overkill. We like grandiose things and you know that's why you put the the big Allianz Arena in and all that stuff so um, let's see I kinda mapped out the places where I wanna put these new buildings and we are going to start out um, I don't know if I wanna put I'm not gonna start with the, well, actually I could uh, right. so we're gonna put the uh, central the Antwerp Central Station, right in the center here. Uh, in fact, I'm gonna go on this side. Oh, no, that's fine. Right there. And this is a, a two-piece building. It's really beautiful. The first part is the entrance itself. Uh, looks like a cathedral, if you will. It's very nicely done. It's not like uh, it could have been even higher quality textures but I think it's great and it is not completed until you put in the um, actual station itself which I won't be able to use the whole uh, how is it gonna work oh so I need a road I need a road next to it okay is it needing a road so you need a road this way Alright, so I didn't I didn't take that into uh, consideration here, but I guess I could do it like this. Let's see. I guess it's connecting, but not really. So that's where the station starts, and the tracks would go out this way. I'm guessing. Uh, so I have to make this working. Uh, I'm gonna put it on this side because I have more space for. Yeah, you're not gonna you're not gonna let me place you right there. Come on. Sweet. It's probably meant to be like behind the building. So let's do it that way. Let's let's do it. Let's do it that way. Let's um have a road. Out that way, switch this around, and then there we go. Cool. So that's building number one. It doesn't have any power right now. You know, it's not functional. Uh, we are gonna put power down to it because, well, why not? I actually don't have a real connection. So one second here. I will actually just go in and put um, a 
solar power covered parking. That might give it enough power. Maybe. Sweet. Okay. Next building. <laughs> Bear with me here. Uh, it's going to be... I should have them all selected. Oh, it's this one. Uh, the Ohm Minster. It's the biggest, the biggest church in the world. And, and you can see somebody created a really big church here. Uh, I forgot to mention, for this part, for this uh, central station to work, you need a separate mod, uh, which will allow you to build larger uh, footprints. And I forgot, what it, I forgot what it is, so break one second. I'm going to take a pause and go check it out. Okay, I'm back. It's called the largest, larger footprint mod. And so you need that one to actually be able to use this. And if you want to use the two, uh, the two railroad tracks together, you have to have a separate mod, which is uh, traffic plus plus, I believe. There might be another one there as well. Okay, so let's get the building that is the big church. Now these kind of all have a place in our city, in a way, because I... I I um I didn't pick anything that was like super um how should I how should I call it? Um that wasn't gonna fit my European design I should say. Uh and I wanna put this one over here because this area doesn't have much I mean it does. Um but it definitely could use more fancy stuff. So we're just gonna put it down Here, which looks like it, it took out the other road. So um, there we go. It's a very big building, and it's gonna tower above everything, as you can see. But that's okay. It it obviously needs a lot more decorations. And things around it, which I will work on that later. I don't want to take time for that right now. Our city is booming as it is. We have plenty of population and plenty of... Uh, well, could use a lot more uh, industry and commercial. But that's okay. Because we're going to put some of these guys in. Uh, and they will create some uh, jobs for us, right? The next one I'm going to do is the big donut. The donut mall. Uh, nobody is going to be upset about having a donut shaped mall in the city, I don't think. It. Let's keep it here. It looks like the donut is nicely built. It's a, there's a quality restaurant like area up top. And there's a big sign called. That, that says out the name. The Donut Mall. Looks good, right? It's not too huge. It's kind of here next to the existing roundabouts, so it kind of, you know, extends that donut shape. I do have to figure out why these are not taking, not having their trash uh, picked up, these parks inside. Maybe I should, like, move it closer to the road. Of course, now it doesn't have, it does have garbage piled up still, but maybe let's, I'm going to test that. If that's what it takes for it to have its trash picked up, uh, then it'll have to do, and I'll put like a second one here. We'll check on that in a minute. Let's go back to the buildings. The next one we're going to do is the uh, pyramid, pyramid and coggle look at ta lookout tower. Um, it's an actual tower apparently from Austria. It's made of wood. Apparently, that's uh, at least I didn't do any research on it, but from what. I saw, um, my mouse is still doing that jazz, that jazz I don't like. From what I saw in uh, the description, right, I do know what I'm doing. Okay, we're just going to go up here, just enough to make a spot for this lookout tower. And my mouse is going to keep doing that, so I'm going to have to toss it out the window. It's probably not even the mouse, it's probably, um, something worse than that my PC could be dying inside and I have no idea so 
Uh, this needs a bit of electricity as well, so thankfully I have these nice little bits of solar. And why don't we spin you around, mister? Hello. Can I right click? Yes, there we go. Almost forgot how to spin a thing around. So it's a wooden lookout tower. Why not have a wooden lookout tower for our harbor? Our harbor needs some kind of a uh, lighthouse type of deal, and this felt like uh, felt like it should be good enough. Okay, so ignore the you know unfinished area here, but we're gonna keep going with all that in mind. Did I have something else? No, I think that was it for this. Um, nothing else in the fourth, fifth, or oh, in the sixth. We have two things. I'm going to do the Drosovia's Sky Garden. It's a hotel. And the hotel itself is going to go out here on the edge of our downtown. Uh, overlooking the bay. Looks awesome, does not it? doesn't it? It's got beautiful gardens up top. You you take you take a you take an elevator up there, I'm guessing, and then you go on this walkway, and you have rooms in each of these domes. And there's a, a waterfall from this pool to this pool. Hopefully, nobody like actually jumps and, um, and you know gets hurt while jumping down there. Hopefully, that's safe. But water is teeming pouring down. This is. Probably one of my favorite of the of all of them um, is a is shops up here where the little donut person is moving. Very cool, huh? And if you if you are in the London Eye, which I actually placed this down just while I wasn't recording just a minute ago, uh, you can see all of these. You can see the Sky Garden. You can see the tower there. You can see the Antwerp. At central station and we can see the, the cathedral I guess it's not a cathedral it's, it's a church you can see it way down there wonder if I can put myself inside the London Eye probably not it'll probably just be like yeah, I don't think it's gonna have me let me climb in Can I climb in? Alright. <laughs> anyway, that was enough fun for that. Uh, wrong button there. Okay, so let's go and put the last... Um, mm -hmm. The last building that I picked out as the contenders for winning this competition. And it's a roller coaster. Uh, and I should probably click on it. <coughs> and where the heck am I going to put a roller coaster? Right? I think I'm going to put the roller coaster somewhere where it's already loud. And that is... Oh, actually, I was... Where was I going to put it? Was I going to put it next to... Okay. Um, give me a second here. Looks like this park is having issues. So, multiple problems. We're going to relocate it. And this other park doesn't have any issues anymore because of having some kind of road access so we're gonna plop it here and the multiple problems should go away which means that this is probably either not gonna have a park in the middle or I'll have to demolish some houses yeah so the roller coaster I thought I was gonna put it out here but it seems like why don't we um why don't we put it out here next to this area? It's it's kind of bad, but it's kind of good at the same time. I think next to the arena itself, we have plenty of other amenities. Amenities? Amenities? The heck, I know. Slope is too steep. Golly, last I checked, there wasn't a slope here. Where is the slope? Do I see a slope? Do you see a slope? There's a bit of a slope. Alright. 
uh, yeah, so these types of roller coasters anyway uh, go out next to loud areas of, of some sorts. So we are going to... It's 500,000 by the way, so we're just going to pop it down. It doesn't actually have a working roller coaster train. Those assets are uh, supposed to be built in and working later. Uh, I don't actually think that the train would actually work in some of these spots. Like, no, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. I just, from some views, you can't see, but the track is completely. Oh, I just punched my microphone while I'm trying to point at the screen, which wouldn't help have helped you anyway. You can't see what I point at. Um, so. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, so that's number. Is it five or six? So two. I think that's. I think that's five. Maybe six. Let me see. So roller coaster. Scratch that roller coaster. Um, the central station. The. Lookout Tower is number 3, 4 is the Donut Mall, 5 is the Sky Garden, and the 6 is the uh, Ulm Minster. How do you not have power? I suppose just like that. One way to fix this is a park. And uh, do we have, I think we have like a 2 by 2 park or not. Four rifle right parking lot? Like, it looks like I could put a parking lot in the, inside the building. Alright, so let's put the parking lot there and let's do a inner city table, which was just over here. That should be nice, right there. And that'll get us power across to the old Minster. And. It's no, you know, for now it's gonna be like that. I'll have to fix it later. <laughs> Don't really like it. Okay, so plenty of things to do to make all this work properly. Uh, like, how about a quicker access to that building? I'm gonna go from here. And. Since my mouse stopped me from going right away. I'm gonna do that for now. I wanna upgrade all of these. Cool, alright. So we're gonna keep on building and uh, continue this. Um, possibly, possibly want to put in the train. Yeah, and, and this whole bit. Um, let me check to see how much time I have left on recording this episode. I don't want to keep you guys for too long either. We also, I also, on my free time, I um, put in some roundabouts here. People are actively using this. And it's working a lot better. Except for, of course, it's going to be traffic somewhere else. Because, you know, there's, you've got to have some intersections without roundabouts uh, apparently they all want to come out this way and then they go out to the industrial area that way instead of taking the you know straight road it's kind of weird um, yeah and this should have the heavy traffic ban and that doesn't Where, where or oh where is Where's the symbol of this thing so I can click on it? My downtown is apparently broken. The the bit where you select the district and you know change things around. Okay, 
you need more commercial so i'll give you more commercial over here um most likely i'll have to run a power line down to the station so i have proper power so let's do that because we have power lines not too far away Here we go. And we need more of everything now. We could probably put more uh, housing in and all of that. But you know what? Uh, we'll come back for that stuff next time. I want I want to maybe beautify this area a little bit and not be boring. If you haven't noticed, last time I looked at this, or I showed this off, I had to make a tunnel out of the motorway here, the freeway, and went underground with it. Uh, Apparently, I also forgot to upgrade these so they don't make as much noise. Just for this section at least. And for this section as well. Since, you know, we have... Um, even the cows and the pigs agree. We have plenty of reasons to keep, to try to keep the noise away. There's plenty of housing and uh, people around. That thing still doesn't have enough power. How do you do that, sir? How do you, oh, okay, I see. Well, I guess, I guess the building itself is only to about here and this is like an extra bit that just hangs off. Uh, Cause they could do that. I don't know how they could do that, but they did. So we will make more. Yeah, I can put more commercial here. Why not? Perhaps. Yeah, let's just connect it. What's it like now? Did it work? I don't think so. It worked! There we go, it worked. It's green, it's blue. Alright. So much fun. I was doing something, right? I was making this more, more cool. Uh, which the only way I know how to make it more cool is by... Putting in random trees. Um... I don't want to hear the cows. And we have the tree brush mod, so we're gonna put in. Now that I think about it, probably I don't want. I probably don't want that many cherry blossoms. I want some cherry blossoms, but not that many. So we're gonna grab these and put a few of these around. Apparently, that's not good enough. And this is, you know, I mean, yeah, whatever. It's it's probably too much, but we don't want to have we don't have, have people shouldn't have like direct access view, you know, to the um, to the airport and the freeway and stuff like that, you know. Uh, of course, you have a chance of easily putting too many trees uh, and. Ruining somebody's day while they're trying to take off their airplane. Um, you know, no big deal. Could be a big deal, but no big deal. Yeah, that's a good one. Press, press plus a little bit, and maybe I shouldn't cover the actual runway approach. That would be terrible. Come on, press the TV button. We go. Um, surprisingly, a lot of traffic on this on this roundabout. Surprisingly, a few trees out here of different kind.
maybe even some cherry blossoms for these guys as well. So they can go out in their backyard and enjoy some cherries. Um, I think, I think those airplanes are clearing. Maybe I'll take some of those. Yeah, there you go. Uh, guys, I don't know if we're allowed to have trees this close to a runway, but um, the man in charge seems to think it's a good idea, so uh, I guess this is what's gonna happen. Yep. How about a forest of these over here? Is that okay? Okay with you guys. Kind of mask this from uh, the road a little bit. Maybe even some other trees in between. Give it a nice mix. This is suddenly the biggest place in town. Uh, I'm guessing all these all these people have landed with the plane, and they're coming out this way uh, because I don't actually have. Uh, yeah, that's what's going on. <laughs> I don't actually have any sort of transport built in over here, uh, which is next on my list. I have to put in at least buses, trains, uh, subways, something. Or else people have to walk over to this station. This is the, the subway station here. The train station over here. Uh, I think there's some buses somewhere around here too. Um, or like you said, like you saw, uh, this bit. So uh, all these guys with their scooters and stuff. They're like, this is, these are the taxi the taxis of uh, Finkelfin right there. They're picking up people. I don't know why they're not sitting at the airport itself. Some of them are. Anyway, enough blabber for me. <laughs> We're gonna sort of get an air view of what we built today. And while we're looking at it, we're gonna put in more stuff. I think we can use more. Um, offices here. And we can use more commercial maybe around this roundabout like that and actually those tiny spots we're not gonna do and more housing you can always use more housing this is our downtown area so why not we'll have that lot with housing Kind of a shift from uh, what we had here because we had the commercial line coming in through the center and now we just switched uh, because we put the commercial in the roundabout and I think that's pretty much it. People want to also, you know, be out and available to live next to the water or close to it and um, this is their chance right here. These few little little spots. Uh, but of course, I have to fill this in with something. So this is all growing and nice. Um, if I was to pick a winner for the best building, I would have to pick between the Sky Garden and the roller coaster. Um, the roller coaster, just because it's like a crazy all custom thing, is not even a. I mean, it's, it's not even a building. It's just insane the train isn't working uh, which is not like a super big deal for me some critics might you know real critics might decide that that's a big deal but um, yeah I don't know I don't know you guys decide let me know in the comments below which building uh, even if it's not one that I uh, showed off here which one you think should win the contest it could be the donut shop mall 
or it could be the big church, which is over across, and we can't really see it. Um, I want to say there's something like that. There we go. Anyway, so let me know in the comments, and I do appreciate for um, I do appreciate you watching this episode. Hopefully, it wasn't too hectic, and hopefully, it was informative. Uh, go ahead and check these mods in the Steam Workshop. Just type in the search uh, "tempted" or "summer contest." But I think all of them will have the tempted hashtag. So if you type in tempted, it will appear there. Um, I, w I even have my episode name tempted and contest to kind of give you a hint how that, how that word is spelled if you're not sure, if you're not an English speaker. Alright, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Please do come back next time. Hit the like button, comment and let me know what you think. And I will see you guys soon enough. Bye-bye.